Hi friends. It just so happens that Netflix finally released a movie that I've been dying to see, Do Revenge. I'm primarily excited for this movie because it has Miss Maya Hawk and I love her. And I know that, um, what's her face, Veronica is in here. And I have seen this movie likened to a modern Clueless. Honestly, what else could you want? Before we get into it, I will say that I've been really sick for the past few days. I'm getting better now, but if I sound a little bit gross, it's because I feel like a little bit gross. I also have a giant container of cranberry juice. It's really cran apple because cranberry juice is disgusting by itself. I know that cranberry juice is a good home remedy for like UTIs and my kidneys were infected. I have no idea if cranberry juice helps with that, but I'm assuming it does. And if it's only a placebo effect, I'm fine with that too. Ladies, future reference, if you ever get a little infection in the nethers, get some cranberry juice. It'll help right away. It's, it's such a good cure. <laughs> and now that I've disgusted you all, let's get into it. Thank you for being a friend. Ten out of ten. And we're starting off with attitude. <laughs> you want to know how you can tell when you've really reached the top? When someone wants to destroy you. <laughs> <laughs> is she wrong? <laughs> In this story, nothing is as it seems. I'm so excited. Does she think we don't know Tara paid for this entire party? Mm. Ooh. It's it's so fucking clueless. It absolutely is. Allegra the Instagram would just saying she saw you by your Justice Salvation Army. Do you want me to push her in the pool? Do you want me to let her hair on fire? I'm obsessed with these girls. I never in a million years would have been friends with any of them. From afar, I can enjoy. <laughs> Tell Allegra to leave. They can do it. She likes shoes and violence. No. <laughs> That's the me of the group. <laughs> My friends were born into this life. I spent 17 years meticulously curating the perfect life. No one was going to take it away from me. <laughs> Do we think that these girls are actually her friends? Doubtful. <laughs> Allegra? Where's Allegra? Uh-oh, call her out, call her out. Generously pledged to donate her entire wardrobe to the Salvation Army. A shady as fuck, but also good for her. <laughs> The only thing that tops shadiness is more shadiness. Hey, Dre. This was his face. Ethan? Evan? Ethan? Who gave him the okay to have so much swag? No, I like him being the soft little gingerbread boy. Not this. You know what? Good for him branching out and getting new roles. He got zero screen time and euphoria anyway, <laughs> except for that really great show at the end. Tonight was really cute and everything, but he is not listening to you at all. You know, maybe you could send me something to keep me company this summer. A little video. A little video? Yeah. Don't do a video. You know that's going to go out immediately. Immediately don't. I love you. <sighs> the magic words. Scam alert. Wave the red flags high. This boy says what he needs to say to get that video. And that video gonna go viral. Don't do it, Miss Thing. It's a blessing when you find, find a corner for the Teen Vogue's not gonna like this. <laughs> I'm sorry, am I being paranoid or uh oh you're not me right now? See, this is what he's all that wanted to do. The camp, oh my god. I didn't do this, I got hacked. Okay, okay. <laughs> I support. Sorry you feel that way. No fucking way. Is this a fully star-studded cast? All of our 90s heroes? <sighs> so I am putting you on behavioral probation. Right, let's punish the girl instead of the people responsible for putting the video out. The number of people supporting this boy? Disgusting. Disgusting! So much for believing women. Exactly. <laughs> I needed to channel my anger. Is this Miss Rodrigo? Do you hear that? Yes, it is. <laughs> I don't care that I'm a grown woman that is obsessed with Olivia Rodrigo. I can't help it. Her music is so fucking catchy. <laughs> Here's the girl we came for. My entire life was about to change and it all started with her. Is that her? <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't know it yet, but we're about to become besties. God, she looks so much like Uma Thurman. Holy shit. Lucky bitch. <laughs> Are you listening to us? <gasps> what the fuck? There are so many people in this movie. My therapist, the beloved Dr. Gratch, says that hurt people hurt people. I don't think that applies to teenage girls. Sometimes they're just evil. Yeah. <laughs> A lot of hormones, you know? It's, you gotta release that somehow. <laughs> and sometimes it comes out as rage. That's what I know for sure. 
pretending I don't even do cocaine. Fra she framed me. Are you listening to yourself right now? Are you on drugs right now? <laughs> <laughs> Bitches are vicious. <laughs> Who's gonna help? Eleanor? I know that sound, you're bricked. Do you want a ride or? What kind of a ride? I know what it's like to get screwed over by someone you thought you could trust. She told everyone that I tried to hold her down and kiss her. Oh, God. She turned me into this predator. She destroyed me. She actually goes to Rose Hill. It's Carissa Jones. Wait, that crunchy granola lesbian? My mom's a nurse who spent her whole life. I'm sorry, is that grilled cheese made with the fucking like butt of the bread? It doesn't even look toasted. I can't fix it on anything else that's happening because I'm disgusted. <laughs> Here we go, bitches. It's time for the school season. You want a tour? Yeah. As a disciple of the 90s teen movie, I would be offended if I didn't get one. <laughs> Horny theater kids. They tried to mount a mostly white production of Hamilton. <laughs> Our farm kids, led by Carissa. Oh, Rose Hill's Royal Court. As she said, a movie like this has to have the lunchroom breakdown, the seating charts of the school. I just want to say I hope we can move on and just be civil this year, you know, especially now that Tara and I are dating. <gasps> You too. Seriously, stop. This hurts. This hurts. As I said, bitches are vicious. I have an announcement from your senior class president. Look, oh God, he's such a tool. <laughs> I want to fight him. Last year was a violation of my privacy. Privacy. This boy. <sighs> Dre, it's in your honor that I'm founding a new club. Oh no. Hetero men championing female identifying students week. Now it is for all. The allies. <laughs> yeah. The absolute disgust that just flowed through my entire body. <laughs> this movie knows what it's doing. <laughs> you know what a woman who's been taken advantage of by a man wants most in the world? Is more straight men talking to them, or about them, or for them. I wish that we could like hire people to take them down. You could just do it yourself. Oh my god. Here comes the plan. Here comes the plan. Here comes the plan. We should team up and do each other's revenge. <gasps> yes. Like the prince and the popper, but fun. I want to burn her to the ground. But if we're gonna make this work, we have to fix. <gasps> A makeover? Oh, please don't say we make A makeover. Yes. <laughs> I, I actually really like this. Absolutely not. <laughs> no, no, wait, how much am I cutting? A haircut, yes. Now and forevermore, the coolest, most mysterious student at Rose Hill. <laughs> I'm Frankenstein, and you're Frankenstein's bad bitch. I'm in love. Narcissists are too busy thinking about themselves to realize they're being played. Love Saunders. Cool. God, can you imagine just like the zero effort to obtain a boy like that? I'm ready to watch him burn into the ground. It's a little pre-homecoming celebration. You should come. Make your exes jealous. You can make your exes jealous and you can make my current girlfriend super jealous. It'll be so fun. Do I really have to wear this? Yes. Yes. <laughs> you are so much cooler than any of those dodos going to Max's party. I want to hang out with these two. Is that weird? Eleanor, Hi. this is my family. Hi. Hi. Hi, I'm here because your boyfriend wrote on my hand. He like really wants me to be here and I'm not really sure why it's so weird. He won't stop following me. <laughs> Should you be worried? But Ellie's one of us now. Oof, the way he just licked his lips. Blech. No, I didn't realize that you also did the Peace Corps summer program, but I should have guessed it because your vibe is definitely all about helping others. <laughs> Ouch. Okay, those root veggies are like my children now. I ate some of your kids yesterday. No. <laughs> They've got a good energy. I support this duo. I live here. So Max is my brother. <gasps> Ooh, dangerous territory. You're a mystery until you're not. Enjoy the cool kids. Yes, full support of these two. This is Endgame. We'll get some drama before we get there, but we'll get there. I have faith, okay? Oh my God, he's hooking up with the Instagram witch. <laughs> Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. 
Was that a picture of himself in like a smoky? I. <laughs> this movie knew what they were doing when they created this boy. They said, What do women hate most? All of those things is what he is. <laughs> Can we talk about it, please? To me, it feels weird that you're talking about my ex right now. It feels like very weird. Wow, he really knows how to use his words. Oh no. Oh, fuck. Hey. Hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Is this weird? <laughs> I was in here, and then you guys came in here, so I went in there. I know what you were doing. You just want me. I'd hide from my party, too, if I could. Come on, I got a cool spot. Ugh. I hate him so much. <laughs> Tell me something nobody knows about you. I don't want any of this. Okay. So proud. So proud. Proud mother. <laughs> Oh? Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. Are we surprised? We put these mushrooms in whatever bougie foodie bullshit Chris is cooking for the senior class ring dinner. While everyone's tripping balls, you steal Max's phone and get us those texts. That was not obvious. <laughs> no, but I love it. <laughs> We just like flying through an entire calendar year without a second to waste. It's not working. It'll be fine. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's for sure working. Did anyone oh. else be like weird? For sure. <laughs> oh my god. Yes. yes. Hey, Matt. Don't do it in the spiders. There are spiders all over your phone. Bye, buddy. Have a good time under there. <laughs> there she is. My hero. Oh. <laughs> my. God. I anonymously tipped her off. <laughs> Double assurance, sweetie. Lock it up. Oh. He's cheating with half the girls at Rose Hill. Are we surprised? That's gotta hurt. Yeah, because it was happening to her the whole time. Sometimes it just hurts to exist, you know? <laughs> a little too real for me. I like you, Eleanor. You're just like me. My fear is that Eleanor is going to start regretting this earlier than Drea will, and that they are going to clash. Like, Drea is going to want to push it harder and further, and Eleanor eventually is going to want to stop, I think. Last year's public assault sent a shockwave through the campus. He was so game to get his side of the story out there. Oh, well, that, disgusting. Disgusting. Vulnerable. So honest. <sighs> The accidental feminist. The rage <laughs> that is boiling inside of me. It's gonna go for a joyride. These two are cuties. <laughs> of course, you have to have a bike scene. <laughs> what? <gasps> oh, Andy's an artist with a studio, of course. <laughs> Oh, they're gonna play in paint. They're both wearing like stark white. They're absolutely gonna get covered in paint. A couple of years ago, when my parents were getting divorced, I... Listen, I feel for him. I do. I, he seems like a real sweetie and I'm, you know, the real artist's lament. However, I don't care. Like, I'm just ready for them to get paint all over each other and have a good time and roll around on the tarp. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> Kiss, 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 yes. <laughs> Good for her. We all like an artist boy. That's a real boy. Founder of the cis hetero men championing female identifying students league. I'm so ready to watch this downfall, bitch. Let him hurt. To figure out a way to show all of you ladies at the school how much you mean to us. More importantly, how much we respect you. The most special someone in your life is you. Gag so. me! Gag me? <laughs> I'm with that girl in the back. Loving ourselves. Yes! And, uh... Here we go. Let's let this shit go wild. Fuck you, Max. Fuck you. I'm shocked! <laughs> I can't believe. Max? No. It's gonna be okay! Soak it in, baby girl. This is your moment. <laughs> Her fucking red eyeliner, are you kidding me? She dressed for the occasion. 
This is bad for us both. How do we spin this? Please make this go away. Baby, I'm on with my dad's strategy. Are you really doing anything for him? How are you doing anything for him? I don't understand. They're poly. It's kind of whack to bind yourself to like some old school ideas of what we think relationships should look like. I have a shot with Max! Mean Girls as fuck. <laughs> of course they would get twisted around in a way that worked for him. Did Yale reject me? I tried to turn her. Oh. This year is, I've been really distracted, but whatever you've been distracted with, I- Damn, she's getting punished for getting her revenge too. Give this girl a break, you know? Every year there's this epic party. It's called the admissions party. No social media, no phones. What's that shit that they, like that shit in Hollywood? <laughs> Like the Illuminati circle, you know what I'm talking about? That's what this feels like. Like the shit in the middle of the woods. And nobody knows if it's real or not. But my birthday is tomorrow. Do you want to like maybe do something together? I don't want to watch their friendship fall apart and crumble. I really like you. No. I want to tell you everything. I'm so happy for them, but if she tells her everything, like, she's going to tell her brother Max. She's not going to keep their revenge plot a secret. Oh, <laughs> uh, all these assholes threw her a party and Drea isn't there. This is my birthday party? Happy birthday. Drea's going to get pissed because Eleanor is not going to be there for her, like, revenge plan. Eleanor is going to get fucked over by this friend group. I think something eventually is going to happen wherein the reality of their loyalty and friendships is shown because I, I don't think they really appreciate her, right? Maybe? I don't know. I don't know what direction this movie is headed at this point, honestly. What do you do when showing- Oh, you can't show up to this. Oh my god. No, Drea, baby, you're making yourself look real bad right now. Look, can't we just put all this ugliness aside? Yeah, you're right. Right. I'm glad you're here, Trey. Have a good time. Max. Ross. Ooh. Max, you'll get your shit rocked, babe. I've watched you hide and cower and cry underneath of a sheet twice now, so in the face of a real fight, I don't think you're gonna go anywhere. What do you think you're doing? You don't answer my texts? What do you think you're doing? This is Mean Girls as fuck. <laughs> She's fallen too far into the pit. <laughs> oh, is that what this is about? You're jealous. I'm with your old friends. Did you even remember that it was my birthday? No. Oh, well, is she honest? You're pathetic. Can't you see what he's doing? Every person in there will drop you the minute you do not serve them anymore. At least with Max, I got a birthday party out of it. Oh, that stings. Because he leaked that video, Eleanor. Are you sure? <gasps> There's never been any evidence. No, Eleanor, no. <laughs> Dead to me, Eleanor. Fuck you, Eleanor. Go home, Dre. Listen, there's still plenty of room for Eleanor to come back from this. However, fuck Eleanor. That's fucked and gross. I love my brother, but you know he leaked that video. <gasps> oh. Happy birthday, though. We'll see you around. Eleanor, you're choosing the wrong crowd, girl, and you know you are. Dre do be acting a little bit a little bit off her rocker, but she's still our girl. And my car is not starting up and I'm worried it's the same issue. But last time someone removed your spark plug, that's why I wouldn't start. Someone was probably messing with you. Eleanor? I needed information only one girl would have. It's our queen, the queen of the north. How are you, girl? Man, I developed an actual coke problem. <laughs> one of the steps to make amends with the people who I've hurt. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I wish you nothing but the worst. Painful death. Who are we here to see? Oh. I want to talk to you about Eleanor Levitan. Is Eleanor the villain? She was sort of my first girlfriend. She had the nose job and the name change, but she told me that you started some fucked up rumor about her that she kissed- Oh fuck, bitch. Drea, you were the one who started that rumor. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. And you fucked over her life and now she is ruining everything for you. <gasps> I want to burn her to the ground. Oh shit. I cannot process this fucking information at all. This evil- 
bitch. But I'm a teenage girl. We're psychopaths. Drea really seemed like she changed and I don't want to hurt her. She was the same mean girl I met when I was 13. I'm fucking speechless. Mom? Hi, friend. No. This is crossing the fucking line. I feel bamboozled. I feel wronged. I feel personally victimized by this movie. <laughs> Narcissists are too focused on themselves to realize they're being played. <sighs> you had me destroy Carissa for no reason. I told you the entire story and you didn't know I was talking about you. You're gonna get back in with your little friends to the admissions party and you are gonna push them to do the craziest shit. And when it all gets leaked, it'll be traced back to an IP address on your computer. Why would she do, why would she agree to this? Got me thinking about your mom. I've recently learned that it's incredibly easy to frame people for having drugs on them. What the fuck? Did I make revenge mommy proud? This really is a Frankenstein Frankenstein's monster scenario, right? Because the monster, the monster is a monster for a fucking reason and Frankenstein cannot control said monster. What? happening what movie am i watching look i don't know what she told you but the revenge thing was just as much her as it was me right no not our blue-haired artist <laughs> there's nothing vapid people love more than making other people's tragedies about them very very true here they come but we still don't like these people right like at the end of the day even if we know nora's the bad girl we also know that this friend group fucking sucks too <laughs> i made some really bad choices this year i'm sorry i forgive you but don't talk to me ever again i know you're gonna tell me to get lost she should i think you're lucky okay you're free drea she lost her entire friend group her boyfriend her public respect and her acceptance into yale so i guess if you want to call that freedom is there a camera on that brooch i created you i can just as easily destroy you i believe in you eleanor I came into this rooting for you girl <laughs> we were all rooting for you eleanor you're so bad you're gonna hook up with both Broussards? Who? Oh. Eleanor used to go by Nora. Good for you, Drea. We used to call her nosy Nora. Oh my god! Yeah. This is so fucked up. Kind of like cheer through the pain a little bit. I don't know. It's all fucked up from every angle. I don't know what to do. <laughs> Send help. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that. Does any of this make you feel better? Because I'm fucking miserable. I feel like shit. So do I. Drea, don't. Are we gonna come out of this together? The only times I ever felt happy this year were when I was with you. Oh, I can have the best of both worlds. And I will regret what I did to you forever. Oh, fuck off. Can we kill him? I know we like ex nade that part of the plan earlier, but could we bring it back maybe? Nobody will know. There's no camera footage. You use me. Because no one would have given a shit about you if it wasn't for me. So I told you I loved you. I got you to make that video. I told you. And then I sent it. I told you. And I'm gonna do fucking coke off a girl's butthole. God, he sucks. <laughs> Who the fuck are you laughing? It's called double assurance. Yes! We got him. Let's do revenge. Yes! First day of freshman year. What is this? I don't know how you get out of this one, buddy. Get a drink, huh? Let's get the music back up! Ellie, where's the remote? Max! Baby! Baby! Break it. Break it. Fuck you, Max. God, we're over. Damn. Thank you. You say goodbye to your daddy's Senate career. Are you threatening her? Oh my god, please let all the women just beat the shit out of him right now. Please. You know me, Elliot. Tell them. Tell them. I think you should leave me. Fuck you, dude. Step the fuck back. Yes. You know, I'm fucking glad I like that video. Ooh. <laughs> We have twist, turned, gone through all the angles possible, but we made it back to where we need to be. <laughs> I'm a bitch, I'm a lover. Hell yes. <laughs> that was a blast. It hit all of the very iconic tropes of 90s teen 
rom-coms. And I love that at the very beginning, she said, nothing is as it seems true to the last drop of this fucking movie. <laughs> I don't think it quite has the chops to stand up to Mean Girls, but like a tier below for sure. I think this has some staying power and can easily become like a cult classic a la Mean Girls, but it doesn't have the hit that Mean Girls has. I don't know what Mean Girls has. It's a magic that I think was captured in one moment in time, <laughs> and I don't know if we'll ever get it back. But this was a, a valiant effort to get there. Just see you go 